on how to do uh, the freeze frame test. If you haven't seen the video, uh, there's a link in the description and you can go check it out. Okay, so uh, how to do it is simple. First, you need to uh, open Motion. You need this is uh, with Motion 5. You can do it with any version of Motion. I'm just using this one. So open it up. Alright, and we want to start a new motion project. Make sure it's in the, the resolution of your video. So my video is in full HD, yours might not. Uh, keep the, make sure the duration's up pretty high and start the new project. Alright, so once you have motion open, first you're going to need uh, your movie. And uh, just make it so... There's some action shot at some point in time in the the video like here uh we got me I take the cup and I'm trying to place it in this imaginary spot and then finally I end the video I throw it and that's that. Now what you need to do is first you need to find the place where you want to take the screenshot from and once you find it sorry it's a little it's lagging a little bit cuz i'm recording but i'm not going to go finding it but to save a screenshot you simply go to share and then you go to save current frame so once you have that saved bring it up and drag it on to, on your timeline and put it uh right there on top okay so once you have your image open, you're going to go, you're going to make, make sure it's selected. You're going to go to the masking tool, and you're going to go to Bezier Mask. And then you're going to kind of go a little more accurate. Don't go all the way to the edge, though, because we're you'll see in a sec. We'll add a little feather. And you cut around it. And then open up the HUD. Add a little feather to it, and there we go. So now it's cut out. Now all you got to do is you got to go into your video and find the frame where they match up. And uh, Make sure you can see what frame that is. Like here, I've got go show frame 630, 630th frame. So I'm going to take this here and I'm going to till we're at the 600 and until its out point is the 630th frame. And that's it. Now, I can't really show you the video because it's kind of glitchy right now, but if you go frame by frame, you can see I throw it. When it matches up, it disappears, and it keeps going. And that is my tutorial on how to do the stop frame in Motion 5. Thank you.